Hello everyone and welcome back to my Hardcore Survival Let's Play. This is episode 7. Sorry about the delay on the episodes. I just had to do some quite a bit of homework this weekend. So I've, I've been having fun doing that. But I've been taking a little bit of time. And I got some of the bookshelves. More bookshelves for the enchantment area. And I decided to um, enchant my diamond sword. I don't know what... I should end up putting a name on it, but it had just the Unbreaking 3 written on it, and then it's also got now Looting. Uh, the Bane of Arthropods is okay. I'd really rather get, like, a Sharpness Sword and combine, um, like, a Sharp 4 with that in order to get rid of the Bane of arthropod Arthropods. But other than that, the Fire Aspect, the Looting and the Unbreaking is pretty good. Uh, the shovel, we only got Unbreaking 2 on, which wasn't the greatest. But, um, today's episode is going to be... I've also been moving stuff out of the house, and these will be for a mining session later on. That we'll end up having, um, just because I know I'm going to need to get some more resources. Uh, let's see, I need wood... So we today, though, are going to be working on the zombie XP farm. So I'm going to, I'm going to do all of it today. So let's do this. Three, four. Uh, that was close, but I didn't have the four that I needed. All right, and then we are going to make the hoppers for this. be so much easier if the one iron ingot thing didn't have to go there to just hold down to do it but it's in it's in an awkward spot so it's not the the best for it all right so for this what we're gonna need is you're gonna want to have ooh that's nighttime let's go to sleep real quick so this is just a really easy this will be a really easy basic zombie XP farm um, I'm not going to put, like, a ton of redstone into it, so that way the, the simpler, for me, the better. So, I'm just going to, oops, my bad, make an iron pickaxe. Alright, we will carry the rest of this stuff with us. So let's go ahead and go over to the mine. I also took down the little hill that um... I will be landscaping this area of the world for us. Um, that'll that'll come out in a in a few episodes later. But um, now let's get in the mine. I'm also gonna be remaking like the mine and everything. I'm gonna I'm going to make everything look better. So I haven't moved everything out of the house just yet, but for the most part, everything is out of there, so I'm not too worried about it. I need another water bucket. Probably should have grabbed one of those before I started going down. Alright, there we go, because then we can make an infinite water source down there, and then we will be set to go. Alright. But yeah, today will be the zombie XP farm, and then... Next next episode, we should be um, all set up with the zombie XP farm, so that way we can just get all the XP we want. Oh yeah, I mined out a little air. I'm going to keep mining, but I did find some diamonds. Um, ooh, I can, I'll can. i come back and mine those with the fortune, with the fortune 3 pickaxe. I'll do that part on camera, but um, we'll see how many, how many diamonds we can get out of the fortune 3 then. But yeah, I want to connect those two spaces, that room with this room, and then I just want to keep going down. Um, I would like to eventually make a, a slime farm. I also, yeah, that's obsidian I've been mining out. I know it looks weird, it's kind of a checkered pattern, but it, it works. Alright, so here we go. Zombie spawner is up here. Nothing should have spawned, and I still didn't, okay. 
I never grabbed anything out of the chest. He's in the water. Right? Yep. I find it so weird that they can somehow spawn in the water there. Alright, let's go ahead and get this started. Let's make the infinite water source that we will need. And then let's fill up all the buckets. Nope, that's the wrong item. Alright. So, to start with this, first we are going to start mining out the floor. And I'm going to need to make walls around this, but for now this is, this is what we're going to want to do. Alright, let's get all of this mined out. Let's start getting rid of all of this stuff for the mine shaft part here. Because we don't need any of this around for making this zombie farm. I ah, could have kept that block there, dang it. Alright, so let's keep going. Let's keep mining this out. Because what I want to do is I want to make like a, a 3x3 around the spawner and have it drop 21 blocks so that way all the zombies are basically going to be a one hit um, one hit and they're, and they're gone so that way I can just get the XP really quick and easy but in order to keep doing that so let's see if I make it make some more blocks all right I need I should have used dirt or something instead this is not working out the best so if I make it to where no because it can't lead into there so let's see I'm gonna have to make it go pretty pretty far down just to begin with so if that one's right here I want this I'm going to need to make this go exactly like this Oops. you don't need a whole lot I happen to get grab the two chests from the spawner but you you really just need a way to your water streams in order to push the zombies in one direction and then all you really have to do is um just either have them fall a certain way or in the other world like I did with my skelet with a skeleton spawner is I had them get pushed down and then I had another water stream down here that pushed them over towards where I towards the, the killing chamber and I could just sit there and farm levels so I'm gonna try and do something like that but with this one I want to make it where it's a fall so that way I don't have to um, continuously swing especially since I am mending right now so let's see we need to go it's one two three Four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ooh, okay. Well, never mind. This won't. This won't work that way with a, with having a killing chamber that'll leave him one swing. And I can't really move that. I can't move that at all. I tried in the, in the other world. I, I tried before to see if I could possibly move a monster spawner with silk touch. Um, this is... Yep. What the... Where do they where do they go? I thought once silver fish spawned into the world they tried to attack you. Yep, there. Oh there we go. Oh nice. 
This is what I want. Alright, let's go ahead and just keep getting this mined out for now. I'm trying to at least clear out a little bit of the space in here. Oh, no. Okay, this water stream is going to have to go. Sorry, water, but you're messing up my farm I'm going to try and make. Yep. Oh, dang it. Alright, where's the rest of this silver fish stone? So that way I can just get rid of it. And not have to deal with it. Oh, there goes that pickaxe. Oh, well, I was using that one mainly for the... Oh, come on. I was using that one mainly for, um... Just mining out that big... The big square. Come on, can I? Can I get the timing just right? Nope. Okay, let's do this. Let's keep getting this all mined out. Alright, I'm gonna have to go up. Alright, let's keep this going. This part will be probably the easier part. The hard part will be getting the water streams correct to, um go ahead and get the zombies to fall in. You know, I like the look of the wooden planks better for the wall. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, there we go. Sorry about that. The game somehow glitched and it wouldn't let me open up my inventory. Alright, for now we're just going to use one of the chests to put stuff in because I'm already out of room in my inventory. Alright, and let's go ahead and do this. Get some of this made. Go ahead and get some of the walls up. So that way the zombies can't do anything else. There we go. Alright, let's get this made. Here we go. This will be done pretty pretty quickly. Oh, that's... Alright. And then we're going to make another crafting table because I don't know what I did with the other one. We're going to go ahead and put that there. And then all I need to do, since it's zombies and they can't do anything else about, that, about it, is to just go ahead. That's in the wrong spot. Alright, let's keep this lit up so that way I don't get killed. Let's actually put some stuff in the right spot. We're going to go ahead and make this. Into the, the square. Now this is where the hoppers come in. So I know I only have four, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try and make it to where... They all, all the hoppers will feed into a chest that's going to sit right here. Let's make that one feed in there. And then we are going to place down the rest of these. So that way the zombies can't get out. You know, I, I'd rather have some cobblestone. 
around the, the edges of this. Bedrock, bedrock looks okay, but I can't get rid of it here. Whatever you do, do not try and break bedrock in the nether in this version of the game, because you can't apparently build past a certain height in this version of it, and you get stuck. And then somehow, I got glitched, where I got teleported to the bottom of the nether. So, it was it, it was weird. It, it is not worth it to try it. I, it. It's just not, because it puts you in a panic, especially when you've been doing decent, or at least good in your world, and then all of a sudden it's like, hey, you can no longer get back, because you can't break bedrock then. So, I would not suggest trying to, um, travel along the roof of the nether in this version of Minecraft, and even though, you, even though you, you should, you'd think you'd be able to, because you can do it in Java, but no, that is not the case in this version of it. Alright, let's keep going. Okay, so they'll drop into here. They won't be able to do anything. Let's go ahead and get rid of this block. Okay, it's up there. Okay, I need to... Where I put my... There's the crafting table. I'm going to need to make a way out. So I need to make some more... Sticks to make some more ladders. Let's do that. Alright, there we go. Nope, that's the wrong thing. I just need the slab. And now let's start carving out the edges of this so that way we can actually end up making like a, a proper place to be able to store things all right let's get going so yeah now all we really have to do is place the uh, the water streams in order to make all the zombies flow into this one area and then we can just sit here there we go, there's some of the silverfish, some of the silverfish stone, or, yeah, that's the silverfish stone, I know there's like silverfish cobblestone and all that other stuff too. Alright. Oh, it went into the hoppers, okay. Let's go ahead and do this, I don't think this should be able to affect how the rate of the zombie farm should do. I think I think we should be good on that still because I think these are I think these are going to be too low for it to do anything to it. Oh wow, there's some lapis. Let's get the rest of that. All right, I don't think we're going to be far enough out of the way. Wow. I can break silverfish stone pretty fast. There we go. There we go. Oh, there's one. Is there more? Huh, I didn't realize that they'll try and find the next thing of silverfish stone that they can any and nope okay um let's actually make the ladder out this way because oh wow sweet there we go okay that's that's awesome i didn't think we'd be finding diamonds while we were doing this but i i will definitely take that so i will come back here with the fortune three as well and mine that out. I hope we can make it up with this pickaxe. We're gonna see. Because I did have to go pretty far down. 
I can hear a spider somewhere. But yeah, I also collected um, quite a bit, quite a bit of wood. Uh, we're not gonna have enough ladders. Where did those ladders? Okay, there. I can hear stuff up there, which does not make me feel inclined to go up there at all. All right, let's make a couple extra ladders. Let's do one more. Oh, come on, game. Don't do this to me. I don't understand why it seems to, to, to glitch out sometimes whenever I'm trying to make something. Alright, let's go ahead and put another torch up here. Okay, so where am I? Aha! I'm in somewhere else. Because this is not a cave I've explored. Cool that there's an emerald there, but this is not where I want to be. At all. Alright, let's um, see if we can make our way back down. It shouldn't have... The mine shaft is literally right past there. It shouldn't have missed it. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can mine our way over towards it. Okay. Well, looks like I... No, I didn't overshoot because I'm going to need to be able to... Alright. Sorry about that. That was that was weird. I thought my calculations were off somehow on how far I needed to be. But no. They were not off. I just went a little too far. So here we go. Let's keep mining out the rest of the walls. Now I'm just going to use cobblestone to go around the whole thing for the water streams. So let's see, let's go out one. And all these torches are going to have to go away, and these walls have to come down too. Alright, let's get all this stuff out of the way. Did I just I mess that up? Oh, one second, please. I gotta get my my mouse to start working again. I accidentally bumped it, and so now the computer, of course, won't recognize it, even though it's the exact same thing that was just in there. It's just having a a hard day today. Come on. Don't do this to me. Nope. Of course it says it's working, but it's really not. There we go. Alright. Sorry about that. Close because it's working for once. Alright. So let's keep going. I'm gonna get all this mined out going to be able to actually have an XP farm so that way I can do more enchantments instead of having to try and fight creepers and everything for XP which is not what I want to do or endermen I'd rather not fight endermen I'm I think though I'm more nervous about having to go to the nether than I am about having to go fight anything in the overworld here or um, in the end because in the end you usually have plenty of um, enderpearls so I never need to worry about usually like falling or anything 
that's where that went. Okay, no wonder I I went way too far. Well, I didn't go way too far. I just thought I, that would be far enough away from the water streams. All right, let's go ahead get all this mined out still. Now I don't want them spawning in that where that water was over there. So let's go ahead and start removing some of this. I'm gonna need to. Let's grab the crafting table because I keep on forgetting to actually keep it on me. <laughs> you'd, you'd think by now I would know to just pick it back up afterwards, but I, I guess not. I'll take the lapis. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Now I need to be able to make a water stream. Oops. I thought I was just like falling to my death there. Uh, yeah, that's going to cause some problems though. This might have to go farther back. this is going to be walled around like this, but the, what I need to do is be able to make the water streams. Let's get part of this floor built in too, so that way I don't keep falling off. Because the zombies can all spawn in here then, I just need to make water streams in case any of them happen to like catch along the edge here. I have to be able to make a water stream that'll end right along the edges of this. So let's keep expanding out the floor. I don't know how far out I'm going to need to go to... I think it's like eight blocks usually is how far water can go in like one single direction. So that's one, two, three, four, six, there, that's seven, that's eight. So let's see, without going in any other direction, how far this water can go. Okay, good. It does end right there. So then that means this needs to be one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, yep. I'm going to have to get rid of this. Move it to somewhere else. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So this is going to need to come out all the way to here. Nope, 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 nope. Mm -hmm. Wrong move. Wrong move on my part. Alright, come on. Let me let me out real quick. You know, sometimes I hate water. I don't want anything spawning in here, so we no. to work. Alright, so let's see. If I put one there, if I put one there, yeah. do I have some ladders? Alright, 
Well, let's see. Because that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So my ladders need to be... Well, why not? Yeah, I'm just going to mine out a tunnel then that comes up to this. And not try and do what I have been doing and making it harder on myself for it. Beat the stick, please. Okay, let's see. There we go. Alright, um, let's put that away real quick. So one... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So let's see. Okay, another pickaxe coming up. I didn't think I'd be going through this many pickaxes and just trying to make this. So let's go ahead and get this done. Actually, I want. I need the wall right there, so that way I don't do anything. Let's pick up the craft. Mm. Why do Why do I do this to myself? All right, we need to make this roofed off, so that way it doesn't have any light coming in. And then I'm going to need to make the walls up there for it. But, let's see, that's... That's eight. So let's go ahead and... Oops. Oh well. Okay, let's go ahead and get this... All nice and set up. Okay. Where's that? Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of some of that other stuff that I don't actually need right now. Okay, let's see how this does. Okay, it looks like I still need something in the middle. Okay, there we go. off let's go ahead and get this part walled in okay let's do that let's go ahead and do this this part needs to be dark as well don't need anything Let's get the rest of this built. I'm going to need the wall along here. And to finish up the rest of this, I'm going to need to go get some more water buckets. And then fill in the rest of the water, take the torches off the spawner, and set up a little place. To go ahead and AFK him while I make while this can run. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I need the walls of this to go out to there. I need them to come around like this. All right, let's do this. some more cobblestone and I know this doesn't like look great but I don't need it to look good I just need it to work that's all I need this to do so let's get am I gonna have to nope I, okay good I don't have to fill in any of that at all so let's go ahead hmm still need a way out for now Can I just mine out this way for now? Okay, yeah, I 
can. And it sucks that I need three, because if I just needed two water buckets to... Mm, that's not... That, that wasn't supposed to happen. That was the wrong, wrong one. Okay, so let's go ahead and put this in there for now. Let's do this, let's do this. Let's go ahead and put this in there. Okay, so for now that's working. And then I need to go... All the way out this way. Okay, so let's go ahead. We're going to get this working. Still going to need to go grab some more water. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So the wall is going to be right back here. Need to go ahead and mine all of this stuff out so that way I can actually make this. Oops. Okay, let's get this going. And then I need to grab some more water buckets. And then I need to complete the roof to this. We're just going to go ahead and do this for now. This will work, and I'm not going to try and mine my way back through anything. Okay, there we go. There's that. Okay, we're going to go ahead and let those fall. Those should fall right into the hopper down there. Let's go ahead and get those out of the way. Let's do this, and it's time to close this one off, and then it should be good to go, and who knows, maybe later on I'll have to, I'll, I'll tweak, it, tweak, it, tweak it around in order to make it more efficient, but for now, I just want to end up seeing how this will do. So let's go ahead... Start taking a look how this could work. All right, there we go. Boom, boom, boom. Oh no, that was a mistake. That wasn't supposed to happen at all. Good thing nothing can spawn in here because I could have just died. Okay, let's go ahead and just put some blocks here. Whoa, okay. Jeez, that was fast. Alright, now that's completely blocked. I know you can hear those zombies over there, so I'm just going to go ahead and take care of them real quick. Well, they're at least only two shot. So, hmm. I made it so that way I can actually move around this. Oh, jeez, okay. There's babies too. Okay, we might have to readjust this then. Alright, let's go ahead and just get these. I'll need to make some more droppers to go around there. But for now, I need to do this. And I wonder if 
they can still probably fit through that. Well, of course they can fit through it right now. Why, why couldn't you just wait? Alright, let's go ahead and do this. Let's go ahead and see. Okay, so it looks like it's it's working, not not the best. But I also don't plan on like sitting down here to AFK while I let it run. I would rather make a platform that's going to be kind of closer to the spawner so that way it will actually um spawn a lot more frequently because I'll be sitting right above it. So I'd rather do that, but for now, it's not the worst. It definitely can use work. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. Let's get rid of more of this silverfish stone. Alright, let's go ahead and get this all cleared out. But yeah, it looks like the torches also aren't causing any problems for this. Oh, I just did that. Let's go ahead and get... I did that too. That's supposed to just be a nice little archway. I'm... yeah, I'm gonna end up making this room actually look nice. Wow, this is actually getting not a ton, but definitely a good amount of zombies for just sitting here. Not... Come on. Fight me. Yep, here we go. Ooh, that doesn't work though. Okay. Maybe we can do that like... Hmm. This? Hey, a carrot. Sweet, that's cool. Getting some different pieces of armor, that's different. Alright. Well, we know it works. I'm glad I at least can reduce the amount of durability I have to use on my sword a little bit. Okay, so it works. Um... Okay, we'll just put some of the extra stuff in there right now. But for now, it works. So I will, uh, I'll get the hoppers, the rest of the hoppers put in. Um, hello. Please, please don't interrupt me again. Um, I'll get this room actually, like, dug out and make it look nice and actually have a proper, like, storage system for all of this and make sure everything is actually... All good to go, and um, I will go ahead and make an actual like exit out of it as well. Uh, but that'll that'll do it for this episode, everyone. So here's a simple XP farm, really, that you can do for. Can the can the baby zombie still get out? It doesn't look like it. Sweet, there we go. Okay, so now we know about that. But um, thank you for watching, everyone. I hope you enjoyed, and I will catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.